Hi everybody. Welcome back to more Dark Souls 2. Well, at this point in the game, I've kind of reached the end of where I know I need to go. You know, I don't know any other paths. So we're going to go tie up a few loose ends. See if we can't figure out where we need to be. And yes, that should be a uh, synonym for spoiling now. Sleeping. <laughs> Alright, so first of all, there's still a locked door um, down by the last giant boss fog. I never did open it. And we're gonna, just going to go check and see if maybe I have the key. Uh, and maybe I can remember how to get there. I know I can go this way. Past the turtle guy and through the door. Hey, turtle bro. Oh, still fat rolling. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. There we go. We also need to go down there and beat up these fire salamander things. Wait, okay. There's the fire. Fleeping. <laughs> Where was that damn door? This one, duh. It's locked. Alrighty. Next up, we're gonna go mess with them fire salamanders. Down there in the ravine. We also need to check if that pirate guy that I talked to in No Man's Wharf has moved to Majula. Because he wasn't there last time I was looking around in No Man's Wharf. If all else fails, we're going to go to try to jump onto a tree ledge and die, probably. Uh, the ravine down this way. <laughs> oh, that fat roll is beautiful. It seems like it, but really, I really don't know because I didn't play DS1 blind, so it's hard to say. Certain areas of DS1 were hard to navigate, but I don't know. I have a lot of trouble in this one. Oh, bastards. This thing's got quite a bit of reach on it. That's good. Thing I, want, I thought about. I knew it. Yeah, equipping the bow gave me. was also uh, added to my weight. I got the pyro flame now. I need to. Oh shit! I got the pyro flame now. I need to check out how that works. Oh, you little fucker. <laughs> okay, now in the door. Oh, they're gonna get me. Ooh, yeah, there wasn't nothing in here. I think. Oh fuck! 
Well, that was unexpected. All those messages around there said that this was a safe spot. I guess they were trolling me, the bastards. Well. <sighs> okay, wrong way. <clears throat> I guess we're just gonna go try to stab him in the butt. I think I could jump over there to that. What do you think? There's a door over there. I can do a little circle thing and run. There's plenty, of, there's always room. for it this time. Well, I can't even go up there anyway. That's some bullshit. Gotta be a different way to get down there. That sucks. Hmm. Block the fire? Maybe that'll work. So far, so good. Sure looks scary, but I'm not getting hurt. Right in my face. I love you, door. Good enough. It takes a lot of stamina to shoot the bow. This is my favorite door in the world.
try door. Oh. Alright, so it's that locked door by the last giant. Alright, where to now? Um. Could be, but I, it, it does make sense. It's, you know, kind of on the same level, and I haven't found any other way that might be going into that direction. Um, okay. <clears throat> couple other people watching. They got their names on there. Are they uh, lurkers? Let's see. Level up real quick. Ah, still need more equip load, man. If I'm going to use this sword, I got to do it. Still no. I need a ring. I need the goddamn um, Avil's ring would be awesome. Alright. Are you? One thing my uh, reliable source of spoilers has told me, he actually asked me if I wanted to know this time. He said, do you want to know something about a vendor that you'd never figure out? I was like, sure, tell me. Oh, I was, said, if I, I the more money you spend here, you might be interested. the more stuff you will have in stock. Work, and I may I'm, 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 I'm surprised. So he has some more armor now. Elite Knight stuff. That was my favorite set from Dark Souls 1. Hold on. 11.7. for business. 14.5. Ooh, it would be so close. That'd be like 72%. Forget to buy. And my Drang Lake armor is like 190 or something. Nothing I've seen even comes close so far. Just spend all our money. Using these probably just to lose them, but whatever. Hello, kitty cat. Oh, <laughs> you do have a time.
Nothing suited you, I presume. Well, that's dismaying. All right. Well, the other thing we have is right down this hole. Oh yeah, I was gonna try one other thing first. Yeah, it's more handy. Plus, you can use more than one item at a time through the inventory. Like if I have a bunch of souls, I can use them all at once. Drop them all at once, that kind of thing. One other thing to check out, and then we're going down the fucking well. Or try to, at least. Uh, here. <clears throat> Plus, you're given a bottomless box right off the bat. Which is cool. But you can sell him to that one pirate guy, I just don't know where he went. I was watching my video and I noticed that I didn't go um, a certain way out here. Yeah, this way. Try to go this way. <laughs> hey, shit there. Okay. One other spot up here. Then we're going down the well. If we can survive that fall, finally. Alright, this is what I was looking at. There's blood stains and messages down there. So okay, wait. I've been there. So I remember this. Or maybe not, actually. Okay, is that all? Hmm. What are you doing, dude? <laughs> Already got it. Alrighty. Um, there's the well and there's a pharaoh stone in one of these houses over here. But I ain't got no pharaoh stone. I wasted it. Stupid wharf crap. Alrighty. It's time to fall down a well. See what treasures await me. Maybe what horrors. Full health, cat ring, hoping we survive.
This could be the time. I've fallen down this crap like five times already. When I had less health. Alright. Here goes nothing. Yeah! Fuck yes. Finally. Okay. Radiant life gem. Whew. Fuck yeah. Needed that. Big time. Glad I healed. And a bonfire. Good. Alright. Okay, um, we'll work on that later. Or there's a way to come from the other side, I don't know. Oh wait, do I have souls over here? Yep. And my blood stain. Well, never mind. I thought I was going to show the replay. Like it does regular blood stains. Nope. God damn it, you weren't supposed to see that. Phantom. Fuck. You nasty. This place looks creepy. Ooh, this looks like Rat Covenant. Seeing some PvP. And some fucked up shit about this Rat Covenant stuff. They can, they can warp you into their world rather than them invading your world. And then all the NPCs are hostile to you. Okay, moving along. Oh, those are some scary looking rats, dude. Here 
there's a locked stone. Uh, I don't know if I want to use it here, though. There's still that one back there in the house, man. Oh, and there's another one. What the hell? Hoping they provide enough lock stones in this game to do them all. Friend ahead. Okay. Another lock stone. Fog wall, another lock stone. On fire. Right by the fog door, that's nice of them. <coughs> I believe you, but that's all the time in this game. Hey! <laughs> Why you gotta scare me like that? I really don't need this sword right now. <laughs> if only I was, huh? be a way to move that thing somehow. There's a place to light a torch. Okay, so this lock stone would bring that that thing down. The lock stone below. Help up. Thinking these rats might be uh, infinitely spawning. That's how I came up. So let's go check this out. Uh, Jeez, there's a lot of lock stones. It's crazy, man. Too freaking many. Alright, that was that. Well, our choices are use our lock stone to get across this or the fog wall. Bonfire, so we're going through the fog wall. Okay, it does, it's not a boss, it's just a wall. A lot of goddamn rats, man. A lot of goddamn rats. These fucking things getting in the way.
Oh, god damn it. Thought I had that one in the bag. Royal Rat Vanguard health bar now appears. And killing these rats does not make that life bar go down. Ooh, this is the rat. Ay, ay, ay! Don't be behind me, bro. Oh, poison got me. Damn it. I think fast rolling is going to be more important than that than one shotting the rats at this point. Okay, gotta be. No good at menuing, but if I need to switch, it's over two. Equipment, sword, over two. Start, equipment, sword, over two. Got it. Okay. Kill a bunch of rats. Switch to the big gun whenever the big guy comes out. That's the plan. Or we just load up on defense and keep using this sword. We'll 
try it this way. One more try before we use a human effigy. Come on, rats. Nope, not him. Oh. Take a chunk out of me, bro. shot just emptied my life. That was crazy. Is there a poison resist on this one too? 40. Okay, so it's the green one. 45, 60. Well, there we go. We got our poison resist on. We got all our life. What are all you lurkers doing? There's a bunch of people watching. Nobody talking.
gonna try to take it a little easier this time. Treat this more like a boss fight instead of me just fighting rats. here somewhere. Fuck me. Fuck me. Mm-mm. Hell no. Hell fucking no. Doing that shit again. Alright. Poison's all the way down. Big guy right there. Where is he? Come on! Ah! Fuck yeah! Get the fuck out of here, rats! That was a bit of a bitch. Hi, rat. Leave this place, human. We have no time for thy kind. Humans bring nothing but filth. Is there a rat tail, human? Past one of mine rat burrows conquered. This will not go unnoticed. Pissed off, bro? Rejoice. For the right to serve me is now thine. Rat covenant, eh? Since thou art human still, permit me ask, wilt thou thy human soul surrender and pledge thyself to me? Perhaps Swears later. thou by the sweet-tempered sludge that laps at our bosoms? Sweet-tempered sludge that laps at our bosoms. Of course, humans are all alike. Get thee gone. We will tolerate thy stench no longer. Another lock stone, that's good. I've got two now at least. This is awesome. This is fucking awesome. I love this shit right here, man. It's like Tomb Raider. Don't give up. I'm not! No! Oh! <laughs> Bleed stone. That was a bleed stone, dude. It's 
Silver Talisman, a tiny charm embedded with imitative magic. Used to transform into something to blend in. Use this talisman to hide from invaders. Also provides the most superficial camouflage, but sometimes that is enough to do the trick. As we all know. Fragrant branch of your fragrant tree branch with a faint sweet smell restores the life of things turned to stone. Extended insulation of the branches scent can lead to coughing and nausea. So that is what I need to get rid of those stone statues. It's blocking my way in a couple areas. Only got one for now. Makes equipment lacerating. An altered state of titanite used to make weapons lacerating or to provide bleeding reduction to shields. Sorcerers at the Melfian Magic Academy once attempted to imbue titanite with various elements but are said to have failed. Someone must have succeeded though. What else would explain this stone? Pale stone, undo him, powers, fire seed, a tiny waning flame used to strengthen a pyromancy flame. Nice. Pyromancy Flame serves as the catalyst for pyromancies and scales the strength of each spell according to its level. Fire is a common object of worship, it can never be grasped, and its mystery stokes the human imagination. Shrine of Winter, Iron Keep, Black Gulch. Okay, moving on. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> that guy definitely didn't have enough room to run, but he didn't know he could just run sideways and then turn, I guess. I don't know. Whatever. Um, do I want it that bad? Really? I don't know if I do. Check out this blood stain one more time. Does he get a good running start? No, he didn't even jump. Well. Haha! <laughs> I rock, you guys suck. Okay. Uh, da -da -da. Who that? Oh god, mummies. Fucking mummies. Fucking mummies! Oh god! Way too much like fucking Blight Town to me. Okay. <clears throat> Let's 
Go to fucking Blighttown. How about it? Great fucking ladder there, huh? Uh, this goes there, this goes there. That treasure chest. Mm -mm -mm. This one. I would really like my souls back too. Please don't die until I get my souls. Please don't fall off anything. I like those souls. Remember when I said I love this part? <laughs> oh my. Fuck this up this time. I'm just gonna fall. Ooh, look at you all pretty down there. Freaking out or what? Hey, you little bastard! Alrighty then, I guess this is the the well. Alright. I'm 
No! Not the treasure. Ash Knuckle Ring. This thing better roll! Tell me it rolls. Where is it? Increases petrification resistance. Knuckle Ring worn by Roy the Explorer. Increases petrification resistance. Petrification is tantamount to death. And in that sense, this Knuckle Ring is a charm that may save your life. Maybe that's about like getting cursed in the other one. I don't know. Alright. Uh... Zombies, dude, fuck you guys. Seriously, fuck y'all. <sighs> Fucking mummies. Token of spite. Rat tail. Severed rat's tail. Demonstrate fidelity by offering it to the rat king and strengthen the bond with your covenant. The rat king is proud and merciful, as any king true to his stature should be. The rat king looks favorably upon those who follow the path of right. Even disgraceful humans. Token of spite. Token recognizing that the owner has traveled worlds to defeat others. When used, you're more likely to summon invaders from other worlds for a period of time. Okay, so you use that and it's more likely that people will invade you, I suppose? Think you are spitting me, motherfuckers! Hey, I ain't taking that shit from you. Fuck! This is like Blight Town, but worse. Son of a bitch! Beautiful bonfire right down there. Hey. Why in the fuck is 
there a tire right there? That don't look like no wagon wheel from the Middle Ages. That looks like a fucking inflatable tire. Statues, don't you dare spit on me. Bonfire. Had to try. Alright guys, I'm going to split this video here, um, just refresh the page in a second and I'll be right back.